Hey guys, uh, Good Marks Goods here, and uh, today I wanted to do a special um, spotlight for these um, six Dematasi spoons. I had, um, I'm still going through and finishing off the the flatware boxes that I bought a, a couple weeks ago, and um, well, I was I've been looking up the um, the patterns and the values in order to know what to sell my pieces for, obviously. But uh, something, once I had um, seen what these go for, they uh, kind of shocked me a bit. So apparently these are very uh, collectible. The, the pattern is called Assyrian or Assyrian head. I think that they look more Mayan than anything, but they're kind of like, kind of like going more into art than than anything, or almost like crossing the um, the art barrier here. Um, not a whole lot to say about them. I don't know how. You know when they were made, but they are marked Rogers, eighteen eighty one Rogers. But the value kind of blew my mind a little bit. Um, normally, a um, generic a generic um, pattern of uh, vintage silver plate that might be like Rogers or Roger Rogers and Bros or W M Rogers or a might. Oneida, the big silver plate manufacturers, you might get a dollar or two dollars per piece. These spoons will probably sell for more like ten. And these are just the Dematasi spoons. Uh, a great way to look at uh, look up the market, and this is how what I trust, is to see what's actually selling on eBay. That'll give you a really good, um, a really good idea of, of the actual value of a piece, because you can ask for anything, but if it never sells, obviously it was never worth that, but yeah, the, um, the Dematasi spoons are going for at least $10 each, and the, the more unusual pieces, like, um, ladles can go for a hundred, um, cake servers, uh, tomato spoons, 40 bucks. So, very thrilled to have found these. Unfortunately, these are the only Assyrian head pieces in, um, in the boxes. But, once, if I can sell them for $10 each, I've made most of the box uh, value out of it. Uh, obviously, there's a lot more in those those bo those 25 pound boxes so yeah y'all keep an eye out, out on for the the unusual stuff that's often where you can make a big profit i i thought that these would be worth three dollars each but the price kind of surprised even me all right that's it